fellow Grenadians, it is a pleasure for me to address you on the occasion of Labor Month 2011. This year, we are celebrating under the theme, Tripartism, Working Together to Effect Change. The theme aptly reminds us of the need for the social partners, government, labor, and employers to work closely together. As Minister for Labor, I recognize the important role of the Ministry of Labor to further create and enhance an enabling environment for good industrial relations. This role is becoming even more challenging given the current world economic situation, which continues to negatively affect us here in Grenada. Both employers and employees are feeling the effect of the crisis in a real way. That is why it is imperative for both sides to move away from the adversarial approach and to show tolerance and understanding and be prepared to meet each other halfway. I urge the trade unions to show restraint in their demands and I urge employers to understand that workers are suffering and not to use the present situation to erode workers of their just rewards. During this month of September, designated as Labor Month, the Ministry of Labor will be highlighting its roles and functions. A number of activities will be held and I urge the public to participate fully so that all can have a greater understanding of what we are required to do. The Government of Grenada has embraced the decent work agenda enunciated by the International Labour Organization. Grenada has adopted safety and health, HIV AIDS at the workplace, labour legislation and developing a labour market information system as our priority areas. It is important for the decent work agenda to be incorporated into a national strategy. The Ministry of Labour and this government, led by Prime Minister Honourable Tillman Thomas, is committed to working with all parties to maintain a stable industrial climate. In the midst of tough economic times, we have to be proactive and explore new opportunities for our people. I therefore appeal to all the social partners to come on board and collaborate more closely with the Ministry as we strive to seek more opportunities for our people. For in the words of former General Secretary of the Caribbean Congress of Labor, Brother George De Pina, we stick together or we drown separately. I want to thank the hardworking staff of the Ministry of Labor, my Permanent Secretary, Labor Commissioner and Deputy Labor Commissioner, Labor Officers and all other staff of the Ministry, as well as the Organizing Committee for their hard work in making Labor Month 2011 a reality. I call on our social partners in the true spirit of tripartism to join with us to ensure a successful month of activities. I now declare Labor Month 2011 officially open. I thank you.